Hello everyone, my name is Radrad and I'm sitting here in my house and uh, it's raining right now. Uh, I wish it would rain hard, you know, because I like to hear it hit my house because I like the way it sounds and all that. And sometimes I'll, you know, be watching the video and notice it's raining real hard and just, you know, get off my phone and just listen to the rain. Cause I like the way it sounds, but... Right now, it's kind of like a light rain. I mean, it was raining pretty good a while ago, which, you know, I was going to, you know, start my video up, and obviously, by the time I get my, you know, everything set up, you know, get my shirt on and my hat on, because, you know, I was wearing a red shirt, you know. Of course, it slows down. But today, I'm going to be reviewing this, uh... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. It's out of frame. It's out of frame. Chester's Poppers Jalapeno Cheese Whirls. Now, like, I don't know if, like, in a previous video, I've said that, uh, it took me a long time before I started eating spicy foods because it was unpleasant. I really didn't like it because, to me, black pepper is spicy, you know? Like, I'm that... I'm that white. But black pepper is like, whoo! It's spicy. So, like, I tried to build a spice tolerance, you know? Like, I'd have sriracha sauce and things like that, and ended up liking it. So, like, started eating, you know, jalapeno-flavored stuff, and I saw these at the Dollar Tree, you know, $1.25 for a little two-ounce bag, and guaranteed these are way better than those horseradishes. I still haven't touched them yet. Um, I'm trying to work up the courage and the willpower to eat another. But I'm gonna try these today and see if they're any count or not. I mean, for $1.25, at least I didn't spend too much money on something if I don't like it. And I mean, if I don't like it, I'll just know not to buy it again. Like those, uh, tragedy of a commodity that was sold to me. But, uh, I'm, I'm gonna try some. And I like how these are you know, kind of like little ninja stars or something, you know, like, you know, like you kind of throw them and like you might be able to cause some damage, you know, like stick them into someone, you know. But like, I don't know if that was three seconds, I don't care. Like, if food falls on the floor, and you know, unless it's wet, I'll pick it up, look at it, you know, inspect the situation, and if I see a hair on it, I'll pick it off. Pick it off. If I see a little bit of dirt, you know, like, or like brushing on my shirt or something, it's fine. It's edible. You know, like, I don't care. No, now, if I would have had some spaghetti and dropped it on the floor, obviously I'd pick that up and throw it in the trash. You know, like a dry food, like, say, if I dropped a chip on the floor and it had been there for 10 minutes, I'll pick it up because I have an immune system. I'm not afraid to have one. So, I'm going to try these, see how they go. Oh, that's nice. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. We got a, we got a half of one. Almost looks like some kind of logo or something. You know? Get my Diet Coke I'm drinking here. Oh, but yeah, ooh, those are really nice. I like those a lot. Yeah, I would definitely buy those again. Those are really good. Like, I like those a lot. Mmm. Like, and they're like kind of like puffs, so like the way they feel, well. I mean. Oh, what is it like Italian? Like, uh, you know, hey, hey, Tony, you know, like spaghetti, pasta, yeah, yeah. Or if it's French, like, 
Hey, yo, oh, I'm French, baguette, hey. You know, same voice, right? You know, purposes of entertainment, same voice. But, these are pretty good. Like, I like these a lot. They taste good. You know, unlike that which will not be named, because it's that, it's pure evil. You know, like, I feel like Harry Potter is going to have, like, a seven-book series trying to defeat that stuff, because it's, it's just, it's that far gone, you know, it's just pure evil. Like, if it tried to produce a uh, Patronus, it would turn into a pile of maggots. It's, it's just that awful. But, like, uh, yeah, like, a dollar twenty-five. Which, you know, you know inflation is real. When the Dollar Tree becomes the Dollar 25 Tree, they don't even change your name. It's like, Dollar Tree. Like, you go in there, and, like, it's been a long time since I've been in the Dollar Tree, and I'd heard about it. Like, Dollar 25? What? Like, like, is it that bad that we have to make things a Dollar 25 at the Dollar Tree? Really? But, you know, I think I've rambled on a little too long, you know, like... I'm not trying to take up everyone's, you know, time. But, Rad Rad.